So much content. Just not enough time. Hello, my name is Flocka, and today I'm here to tell you that my content is too fire and too ambitious to show you all of it piece by piece. We're gonna have to just give you a massive update video, so here it goes. The Mega Farm. One of the greatest builds you've ever seen in LEGO Fortnite, I promise. We're gonna start off with the manure slurry storage thing that I made. Uh, I used some up to, upside down building mechanics and some regular floor pieces to make it look like actual manure. Uh, put some uh, of those Star Wars pieces on the side, which you're gonna see is a common theme in a lot of these upgrades that I have made. Uh, if you haven't gone and grabbed yourself any of the Star Wars bundles, any of the lighthouse stuff, or the barn kit, make sure you do that the next time it comes in the shop, next time you get an opportunity. These pieces have been absolutely instrumental in upgrading my world in LEGO Fortnite. You're gonna see uh, I had some storage in there. We're able to store all of our poop now. We also made a spot for some berry growth. We're gonna make this a little bit bigger in the future vertically, uh, but we wanna make sure that we handle the build limit first with everything else that you see going on around. Right here, we needed a spot for the villagers. If you saw the last farm video, there was no spot for them. And we just had workshops and uh, chests everywhere. But now we've got it all organized. I figured if the animals had a place to stay, they had a roof over their head, why can't the people taking care of them, right? We're all about human rights here. We gave them a place to perform, maybe enjoy their time off. I've still got a few details to add, but like everything else, like the garden, I gotta make sure that I handle the build limit with some of these big functional builds first. Speaking of big functional builds, here's the Mega Silo. I never did a video on it, but it holds 63 chests worth of grain, worth of produce, worth of loot, whatever you want to store in there, and the massive wheat field behind it, it's nurturing over 200 wheat plants. Absolute insanity. I'm surprised I didn't hit the build limit on this field alone, but nonetheless, we got it in. Not even a single complexity error, not even a single bit of lag when we put this in. This is absolutely incredible. We're gonna walk around and take a look inside. On the inside, you'll see nine chests on the left, nine chests in the front, nine chests on the right, to total 27 on the bottom, and then we've got nine chests on each wall up top, to total 36 on the top. That equals the 63 grand chests in total for storage here on the Mega Farm. We're never going to have to worry about organization again. Moving on the massive barn, farm hanger, the vehicle hanger, tractor hanger, whatever you want to call it. We're going to be looking at these vehicles. I have a, uh, a video on the truck and the trailer if you want to go check it out. But we're going to take a drive. So as the great Russell Wilson once said, let's ride. Like I said, you can go check out that video. I'll link it in the description. We gotta move on. Cause look at this cedar. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You know you like that. Hey, check it out. We use the Tatooine storage bins, the hazard bins. I forget what they're called. And then um, I believe those little cool spindle things you see are from the uh, the Anarchy Acres bundle set. Like I said, a lot of bangers in those sets. We made it a trailer and we pulled it on the tractor. Check this thing out as we steer around the farm here. It works really well, It, I mean, besides the visual glitches, but it doesn't come off the hitch, it drives nice, and it works like a real cedar. We went ahead and threw some corn seeds in the back, so whenever we harvest, we just drive through the field, do a little RP, you know, plant those seeds. Oh yeah, it's fresh. Uh, you know you like this build, guys. 
And if you're enjoying the video so far, make sure you hit the like button below and consider subscribing to the channel because we're dropping bangers like this all the time. We're going to go ahead and park this thing in the garage because we got to move on to the next part of this build. Now, I know a lot of you have already seen this, but here is the windmill. We'll also link that bad boy down in the description. Like I said, ba 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 bangers This thing works. Look at this view at night. We got the lights on. I know I haven't shown you this view. Ooh, wee, baby. But all that I've shown you, and I still got more. Yes, sir. Look at this airstrip. We used tons of the Star Wars pieces to make this. It looks incredible. It's giving me speed, way, vibes. And like I said, if you can't tell how big it is, I, I did a little fly over here. Look how freaking massive this place is. And we're not done because we got to house this twin engine plane that we've been working on. Check it out, guys. Have you ever seen something like this? Mwah, mwah, chef's kiss. Enough glazing. Back to the build. Look at this. We made it look like a little sewer grate underneath here and put like a little hobo spot, just a campfire, right? Like cooking their beans and just chilling there at night. Put, put some diagonal chairs up just to make it look snazzy. I think this spot looks cool. Maybe we'll add a little bit of garbage, some, some, some more detail. We'll see. But up top, if you were wondering what this tower was, we've got air traffic control coming in. Big tower. We're going to be storing all of our power cells and biomass in there as well. There's multiple floors, so we'll have tons of storage space. And then right here, the big vehicle hangar. If you're wondering how I'm not hitting high complexity, it's because I'm not adding a lot of detail to some of these things. Some of these builds don't need detail on every little freaking inch, guys. Spread things out. It still looks good. The proof is in the pudding. Look at this. Like I told you, we used all of the Star Wars pieces. We used all of the Anarchy Acres pieces. We used all of those Lighthouse Bundle pieces. They're freaking amazing. Look how amazing these lights are. Look at them. They have been, oh, oh, W updates, W content for real. I don't have a creator code, so if you're going to support anybody, I'll drop a few of them down in the description. What a banger video. I hope you guys enjoyed. My name is Flocka, and if you liked, please consider subscribing. I'll catch you in the next one.